Well, hi, this is Chase Swift, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to have two windows open side by side on your Mac. Right now, I have a um, Safari window over here, and I have a Safari window over here. I also have a Pages report that I'm working on. So I'm going to show you how to do multiple applications, um, basically having two windows open side by side. And so first, we're going to start with Safari. Now, it doesn't make sense to really do this, to switch between windows. The best way is to actually uh, initiate this side-by-side -side feature. So all you have to do is click on the little green full screen button and click and hold just for a second. And you can see the background goes light blue. And this is lighting up the left-hand side of the screen. If you want this window over on the right, just move it over to this right side and the blue will highlight over here. And if you release, this window will appear on the left side. I'll put it back on the left side and then I'll just release. Then what um, your computer will do is give you the options of the other windows that are open, the other applications. And for this uh, first attempt, we're going to do the other Safari window. So I'm going to click and it automatically fills up the other side okay now what's nice is you have this little splitter and it's right now it's it always defaults to 50 50 but if you click on the splitter you can move one side smaller or the other side um, smaller and so however you like it it will sit and then you'll have again this is safari so i have one web page really nice uh, if you're looking to say like the mac book air uh, but then if you want to look at the iPads you can look over here so now you have basically two windows open uh, side by side so the way to get rid of them uh, and go back to normal is just find uh, the full screen button the green button just click it once okay that'll return this window back to normal size the other one is opening in full screen so you may have to uh, slide up on your trackpad and go to the full screen side over here, desktop number two, because Safari is still full screen on that other window. Just click there. Um, and actually, really, what you can do is, you see this little symbol right here? That'll also reduce it to normal window. But if you miss that, you can just click here, and then just go up to the full screen green button and click on it. Now you're back to your two windows, uh, ready to go back uh, to other, th other projects. Now, in this case, we're going to take a Pages document, and uh, we're going to mix Pages uh, document with Safari window. Okay, So I'll go ahead and start on the uh, Pages document. Click on the green full screen button, and again, the light blue lights up. I'll put that on the right-hand side. I'm still holding on to the green circle. Uh, with my mouse. I'm not letting go. Now I'll let go and it snaps to the right hand side. Now I have these available windows and I think I'll do the MacBook Air. So I just click once and it fills up the left hand screen so I can browse the web and then I can work on my report. Um, and again you can use the slider to change the sizes in between. Okay, So there you have it. And again you can just um, go back to normal by clicking the green button once and then uh, on the trackpad on your MacBook Pro just go up and you'll see that little uh, those two arrows pointing together that that will uh, minimize that window so just click that and then you can pick whatever window you want to go back to and now we have all three windows and I have my pages report right there so that's pretty handy how to basically quickly um, you know share two windows open side by side and it can be any application um, on a Mac so hope you enjoyed this video and if you have any positive comments uh, I would love to hear those and uh, certainly subscribe if you want to know more tips and tricks about how to do things on a Mac this is Chase Swift have a great day bye for now